Local immunity and cell-mediated immunity, we've already mentioned that local immunity is very critical, especially for mucosal diseases like canine infectious respiratory disease complex and feline infectious respiratory disease complex. We have to protect the site of infection, and so you want to have that local immunity. And, of course, cell-mediated immunity can and does play a key role. Interestingly enough, the vaccine titer also tells us whether or not our vaccine has induced cellular immunity because one of the things about humoral immunity for a complex antigen like those that are in vaccines, cellular responses have to occur, so-called T cells or thymus-derived cells that are important in cell-mediated immunity actually help the B cell produce antibody. They need that help. So when we're looking at titers, we're not only looking at antibody or humoral immunity, we're looking at immunologic memory, and we're looking at one aspect of cellular immunity as well. And that's the role that T cells play in helping B cells produce antibody. So that's why when we don't have an antibody response to a complex vaccine like distemper or parvo of either species, canine or feline, then you really probably don't have any immunity, and that's why you should revaccinate. So don't count on having cell-mediated immunity. And for rabies, if you personally, as a caregiver, don't have a rabies titer, don't depend on cell-mediated immunity to protect you against rabies. The important protective factor against rabies is really antibody. That's why we use uh, gamma globulin or antibody that's injected right at the site of a bite to help destroy that uh, rabies virus. So, Antibody testing, detection of antibody in a dog vaccinated with an infectious vaccine then, as I just said, not only looks at humoral immunity but looks at cellular immunity, and that's critically important to understand. And most people would say antibody testing has nothing to do with cellular immunity. Antibody testing has nothing to do with immunologic memory. It has a lot to do with both of those as well as humoral immunity. 